All right, guys, it's 2023. I think it's about time. So it's been a hot minute since we was last on Battle for Neighborville. But we are here to jump back into some of this game, which is hit or miss for some people. Some people absolutely love this game. Some people absolutely hate it. For me, I'm sort of in the middle. I think the single player of this game is absolutely incredible. I think the multiplayer is a little bit... Mm. But we do have the Valentine's event going on. I forget that Super Brains has a shield in this game. I kind of forgot a lot of things to do with this game, but we are here with Valen Brains going on. What do we have for multiplayer right now? We have the Boss Turf Takeover challenge going on. Turf Takeover, Team Vanquish, and Garden and Graveyard Ops. Wait, so we don't have any of the other modes? They don't have a mix mode permanently? Really? Yeah, we're missing out on Vanquish Confirmed, Suburbanation, Gnome Bomb, Battle Arena. You know, that's four modes right there which are not available unless you do private play. Well, we're going to jump into some Turf Takeover because it's here. We actually got a pretty decent map. I actually quite enjoy this map. Hopefully, we have a decent amount of people still playing this game. If you guys still play Battle for Naperville, let me know in the comments. I Ideally, if I do want to carry on playing, I kind of want to get all of my characters, like, completely, like, prestiged up to the top at least to like master or something like that so i guess we're gonna start off with the engineer and we're also gonna look like the painter as well because why not i remember i think the engineer was one of the first characters actually played properly whoa now what i'm gonna have to get used to again is the fact that you can sprint in this game so it's gonna be very weird seeing lots of you know, plants running for their lives as they... Oh, oh, I see you, Acorn. Yeah, there you go. And then I forget we can use these turrets for, like, rapid fire, can't we, as well? Yeah. Oh, hold on. Let's get a cheeky little revive in here. Maybe we'll try and lock down this area here. There we go. A couple of plants over here that we can take down. We got one of them. We got ourselves a cheeky little prize bulb as well. There's another kill as well. Hang on a minute. What's this yellow beam? Oh, that's the boss! Oh, that's the boss, isn't it? Can I not get this yet? Or is it just the plants? Can only the plants get that? I can't remember. What I do know is this sunflower wants to wants to go down. There we go. Right, I think that might only be the plants that can get that. I thought we could spawn them in as well, not gonna lie. I don't think the plants knew they could grab that chest and spawn in a zombie. I thought both teams could fight over that chest, but it is kind of based in the plant's base, so it's just we have to stop them spawning in that boss. The plants have to claim that boss as their own, and then they can use that to their advantage. Feels like magic, feels like magic. No, I want to be the attacking team. Come on, let me be the attacking team. Mm. All right, so we're on the plants this time. Unfortunately, we are defending again, so we cannot claim a boss for our own. But we're starting off as a Snapdragon. I actually really like this character. I think the design is really cool. I forgot half of the abilities. I can do like a, a super attack like that. Yeah. And then I've got like a homing attack like this with a scientist. And it didn't home in on him. It kind of like just hit the ground. Oh, there is a boss chest though. I would love if we could get that for ourselves. But I don't think we can. I'm going to head over there now because there is like an icon this time. So I'm just going to check to see if we can get it. Oh, keep away. Keep away. Go away, wizard. Right, can I claim this as my own? Oh, I can! Why couldn't I claim the last one as my own then? Yo, we got Pickle Rick with us. Go on, Pickle Rick. I know it's Dill Pickle. It's still Pickle Rick though, isn't it? Come on, Pickle Rick. Get those kills. I want to see all of the kills in the kill feed due to Pickle Rick. Let's see if we can use this to kind of give us a boost. Not really. Pickle Rick's still holding his own, though. He's still coming on strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have some of that slidey, boy. And a wizard. And a wizard. And more flames. I'm just spamming my abilities at this point, to be honest. I have no clue what's going on. Engineer. Oh, I see you, Engineer. You're mine. You're mine. I'm dead. I'm dead. Something's attacking me from behind, and I don't know what it is, but I'm going to fire this down there and then run away. I'm going to run for my life. And the zombies spawn a boss in. I didn't even see the notification for the chest. I'm going to call hacks. Ah, no! Get away, boss! Oh, I'm just running for my life. Sprint and jump, sprint and jump. That's the technique. Oh. Oh, 
Oh no. And we're dead. What was that? That still found me? I thought I was out of the zone. I guess not. All right, let's see if we can take down this Gargantua. Let's try and keep him in our fire. Do as much damage as we can. There we go. Woo. I feel I need to change character. I feel like it's not working right now. So let's go as, I don't know, maybe a pretty balanced character like Nightcap. This one isn't broken and overpowered at all. Surprise! Oh, you didn't expect that, did you? You didn't expect the Nightcap hiding around here. Oh, I also didn't expect a scientist to be right there. Or an engineer. Oh, we do have a, a boss chest now. Let's see if we can get to that boss chest quickly. Looks like we have a couple of team members there already. But they captured the objective, so the boss chest has now despawned. All right, we're going to be a bit stealthy. We're going to kind of hang back. First of all, we're going to try and see if we can kill this wizard. Nope, the wizard's gone. Because you can sprint and you're gone within seconds. I'm going to try and hide and then pick people off one at a time. Nope, instead there's an AI zombie that decides to come backwards. Whoa! No! Go away! I'm trying to be stealthy, okay? Now, right, we're gonna kill that scientist like that. There we go. Oh, there is a foot soldier. Foot soldier has seen me. Oh, wherever could I have gone? Oh, yeah! We need to stop them from grabbing these bombs and blowing up our marshmallow mortar thing. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't have hanged back. Okay, it's automatically teleporting me back now. Okay, so as I was planning on being in a place where I could still attack the zombies, the game was like, nah, nah, let's just teleport you to the other side of the map now. Oh, wait, there's a zombie coming this way. Get away, super brains. Keep away, buddy. This bomb's almost run out, so we gotta make sure they- No, they got it! There we go. We got one. We got one. Alright, we got one. See if we can get this wizard while he's a bit dazed. There we go, there we go. Oh no, they picked the bomb up on the left as well. But they seem to be going backwards. They're going a different direction. Interesting tactic. Don't really know what your play is there, but sure. You do you. Oh, 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 there's a sneaky... There's a sneaky boy over here. Come here. There we go, sneaky devil. You don't get past me, son. Where am I being attacked from? Oh, Ulster. Oh, we missed the bomb. He missed the bomb! Oh no! He was doing so good! We was on a really good streak there as well. Are you reviving me there, Chomper? Well, they were just dancing on my body. But we're back in the action. And we're dead from the action. I'm not going to push too far forward because I kind of need to protect our little marshmallow mortar thing. For example, they're trying to run across the bridge. Captain Deadbeard's going for it. Captain Deadbeard's dead. Oh, oh, we got a couple of zombies coming in. Surprise! Yeah. Oh, did we win? Oh, we won! Oh, I don't mind carrying the team, you know? Do you know when the game first came out, you could actually walk all the way back to the beginning. So you could actually be next to the statue when it got hit by the marshmallow in the animation. Whereas then they did add uh, the teleport feature just so you couldn't do that and so that people kind of stayed in the action. Look at me carrying the team there guys. I got the most vanquishes with 21. I got the most assists with 9. I got like 10,000 healing. 7 revives. I was carrying. But nonetheless the guys, I do want to try and 100% this game so I want to try and get all of these single player modes 100%. I've still got some I need to do there and then if we could try and at least get all of our characters to like master that would be pretty cool as well. But thank you so much for watching, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy, and I will catch you all in the next video.